What's up, Western? These are your daily announcements for Monday, May 18th. Mrs. Keenan and Mr. Heidenberg would like to say a huge thank you to the tech crew that helped make Celebration 2015 such a terrific success. Thanks to Brianne Letourneau, Craig Ziemer, Noelle Vogel, Doran Richard, Nick Pickvit, Autumn Aspen, Emily Tinglin, Cole Thompson, Haley Gray, Morgan Andrews, and Josh Wood. We really appreciate everything you did. Palm Trials will be held May 27th through May 29th. Trials will be held in the Commons 5 to 7. If you think you are interested in trying out, please attend an informational meeting today. May 18th at 3 p.m. in the Commons. If you have any questions, please email Coach Amber, bcwpompon at gmail.com. Attention girls interested in this fall's WHS sideline cheer. Trials will be held May 19th and May 21st from 5 to 8 p.m. in the upper gym. Teens will be posted in the athletic office on Tuesday, May 26th, and the parent meeting will be held on Wednesday, May 27th. If you have any questions, please see Ms. Glazier in the athletic office. All students are welcome to stop by the volunteer board and check out the new opportunities. We need many volunteers to assist with the Culp Fun Fair on Saturday, May 29th from 4 to 9.30 and for the McKenzie 5th grade banquet on Thursday, June 4th at Monitor Township Hall from 5 to 9. Sign up outside Mrs. Riffle's room, B112 today. Military visits. Recruiters will be here doing bone touches as follows. Navy, May 20th. Marines, May 26th. Army, May 27th. Seniors, please don't forget that you must record 12 volunteer hours as part of your graduation requirements. If you have completed your hours and have not turned in your cards to Miss Riffle, please do so as soon as possible. Prom pictures are in. Please stop to see Miss Schumacher in the attendance office to pick up your picture packet during lunch or after school. The application for the summer session of E2020 is now available. The session will run from June 15th until July 30th, from 8 to 10 or 10 to 12. Please see your counselor if you're in need of any credit recovery this summer. The deadline to submit your application is June 2nd. Don't wait, this session fills up quickly as we accept students from other schools as well. Mark your calendars. The Western Athletic Department will be hosting a discounted physicals night on Thursday, June 4th from 5.30 to 7.30 p.m. Please arrive through the high school main entrance doors. The cost will be $20 per person. Come in and obtain your student's physical before summer workouts begin. Medical professionals from Total Family Healthcare donate their time to allow this night to serve as a fundraiser for the athletic department. Anyone can obtain a physical. It is not limited to Western High School or middle school students. If you have any questions, please contact Lisa Glazier at 989-662-2700. We hope to see you there. Congratulations to the boys track team and their strong performance at the MHSAA Regional on Friday. Qualifying for the state finals were Alex Schlatter, regional champion in the pole vault, Drew Pisha in the high jump, and the 3200 relay of Evan Borwerk, Matt Bullett, Brennan Nesbitt, and Lauren Apple. Good luck at Valleys on Wednesday. Why was six afraid of seven? Because six has issues. Need math help? Attend Math Lab on Tuesdays in room A221, Wednesdays in room B213, and Thursdays in room B215 from 2.30 to 3.30 p.m. Students, please come out and support our varsity lacrosse team as they take on Flint Powers this Thursday at 7 p.m. This is the first time in history Western is hosting the second round playoffs. The Warriors defeated Flint Powers 15-14 for the first round victory on an amazing overtime goal by Joey Bullett. Come and cheer on our fellow Warriors this Thursday. All library books are due on or before May 21st. All textbooks are due to the library by June 10th. The library is open to receive books at 7 a.m., between classes, during lunch, and after school until 3 p.m. The girls track team competed in one of the toughest regions in the state Friday night, placing 10th out of 15 teams. Madison Marciniak placed 7th in the 3200 meter run, while Becca Eastep teamed up with Molly Hecox, Grace Kenzorziak, and Aaron Hacker to take 6th in the 3200 meter relay. Taylor Ann Allery placed 8th in the long jump, while Brooke Fielder took 5th in the high jump. The highlight of the day came from Samantha Lukens with a fourth in the shot put and then a second place in the discus, which qualified her for the state finals in Rockford on May 30th. The girls track team finishes the season Wednesday at Northwood University for the Saginaw Valley Conference Championship.